Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today in this video we are going to discuss about pharmaceutical microbiology. So, in first unit we have seen the, um, first is what is meant by microbiology. Microbiology means study of small or micro living organisms. It is followed by our father of microbiology, Anton, Liu and Hawk. It is described in our nucleus study of animals. Uh, the microbiology includes different branches these are virus bacteria algae fungi and protozoa the study of virus is called virology the study of bacteria is called bacteriologist etc these uh, microorganisms are used for production of breeds cheese bees and alcohols vaccines vitamins and several antibiotics microorganisms found in oceans seas and necessary for the place of microbes some microbes are useful in medicines example penicillin this is an enzyme with the help of enzyme and antibiotics we can close the micro organisms bacteria and protozoa comes under any nucleus in 50 to 300 and microscopic lens we can see the microorganisms spontaneous generation conflict in early times human beings believed that living organisms could develop it that non-living or decomposed matter these first challenged by Rudy Needham Spallanzani. Louis Posture was settled this conflict once for all bottleneck ex by using the bottleneck experiment. The objective role of microorganisms in disease Barsi showed that silkworm disease was caused by fungus. Barclay and Posture showed that microorganisms caused by disease. Joseph Lister developed systemic first sterile surgery. Robert Koch established a relationship between bacillus anthracis and anthrax, isolated the bacillus that caused tuberculosis. Charles Chamberlain discovered viruses and their role in disease. Koch postulates. Microorganisms must be present in every case of the disease but absent from health individuals. The suspected microorganisms can be isolated and grown in pure culture. The disease must result when the isolated microorganisms is inoculated into a healthy individual host. The same microorganisms can be isolated from the disease host. The next is the isolation of microorganisms. During coach studies, it becomes necessary to isolate suspected bacterial pathogens. Method of isolation The cultured bacteria on sterile surfaces of cut boiled potatoes not satisfy. Regular liquid medium solidified by adding gelatin, uh, gelatin method at the temperature 20, uh, 28 degrees centigrade. Fanny Elishmas suggested the agar at 100 degrees centigrade to melt 50 degree to solidify. Richard Petrick developed a petri dish a container for solid culture media. This is the whole method for isolation. Louis Posture In duration of 1822 to 1895, he developed vaccines for chickenpox, rabies, anthrax. He demonstrated all the fermentation. Uh, fermentation means it is a technique to kill all microorganisms where due to activities of specific yeast and bacteria developed um, pasteurization to preserve wine during storage mainly foods he discovered the fermentative microorganisms were anaerobic and could live in absence of oxygen other developments uh, Bingo Gradaski made many contributions to soil microbiology uh, discovered the soil bacteria could oxidize iron, sulfur and ammonia to obtain energy. Isolated anaerobic nitrogen fixing bacteria studied the decomposition of cellulose. These are the other examples. Studies on genetic code, mechanisms of DNA, RNA, protein synthesis, regulation of gene expression, control of enzyme activity, development of RDNA technology and genetic engineering. So. Uh, next is the scope of microbiology. Microbiology shows impact on medicines, agriculture, food science, ecology, genetics, biochemistry, immunology and many other fields. Example, virus, virologist, fungi, my mycology, bacteria, bacteriologist, algae, protozoa, etc. M medical microbiology. 
deals with the disease of human and animals to identify and to eliminate agents causing infectious disease immunology to study of immune system from foreign pathogens agriculture microbiology impact on microorganisms on agriculture plant diseases that attack important food crops food and daily microbiology to prevent the microbial spoilage of food and transmission of food born diseases use microorganisms to make food such as cheese pickles yogurt meat etc industrial microbiology using microorganisms to make products such as antibiotics vaccines steroids vitamins enzymes amino acids alcohols genetic engineering in engineered microorganism use it to make hormones antibiotics vaccines and other products some viruses are a cellular and possesses both living and non living characteristics they are considered neither as eukaryotic nor prokaryotic so this is the introduction for microbiology hope this will be useful for you if you like the video please like share and subscribe and don't forget to subscribe to my channel thanks for watching